ان لله نحمده ونستعينه ونستغفره ونشهد ان لا اله الا الله واشهد ان محمدا عبده ورسوله my beloved brothers and sisters assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakat on behalf of myself the entire executive board and the entire team here at masjid as sadiq we want to wish you and your family a hearty Ramadan Mubarak, Ramadan Kareem, Ramadan greetings. Indeed, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has answered our dua. We've made this dua, Allahumma baligna wa Ramadan. O oh Allah, allow us to witness this month of Ramadan. And He has answered our dua by allowing us to witness this month of Ramadan once again. Indeed, this Ramadan is like no other Ramadan that we've ever experienced. Some of us are still mourning from the loss of our family. Some of us are in hardship due to the loss of income, which brings uncertainty. We begin this Ramadan in isolation in our homes. There will be no gathering for Salat in the Masjid. There will be no Iftar with friends and family. There will be no Salat al tarawi in the Masjid. There will be no Qiyam al layl in the Masjid. Yes, our hearts ache for the camaraderie and the motivation we get from breaking our fast and praying with our brothers and our sisters. However, even though this Ramadan will be vastly different, even though the doors of the masjid are closed, we know with certainty that the opportunity to enter Jannah from the door of Ar Rayyan is real and that there still exists the benefit for us to be able to enter Jannah through this door by fasting sincerely for the pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala this month. The core focus and benefit of Ramadan has not changed. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us in the Quran, O you who believe, observing fasting as saum is prescribed for you as it was prescribed for those before you. Why? It was prescribed for us so that we may become al-muttaqun, we may become the pious. And so this fasting for us is something to help us achieve, achieve piety, attain a consciousness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And indeed, this is the core benefit of fasting, the core benefit of Ramadan. And so we still have the opportunity to become al-muttaqun by fasting sincerely, by listening and reciting the Qur'an, by giving charity, by being good to our family and our neighbors, and by performing our salah, whether it's the required fard salah or any of the optional salahs that's available for us to perform so that we may multiply the rewards. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala may multiply the rewards for us. Ramadan is also the month of the Qur'an, and the team at Majra Sadiq is doing our best to help us achieve these goals for Ramadan with various programs and activities throughout the month. First, our Quran verse spotlight this month aims to help us reflect on the Quran, reflect on the words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. On Mondays and Wednesdays, we will be sharing a video on YouTube and on Facebook. These videos will highlight a verse or a passage from the Quran that might have some meaning to you we invite you to reflect on it, reflect on its meaning, and provide your own perspectives on how its meaning has impact on you. You can sub submit your responses directly back to us on Facebook or on YouTube chat, and your submission might be featured in future videos. Next, we are also going to have some live sessions to make sure that we can continue to be reminded of the opportunities that are in front of us this month. On Thursdays at 6 p.m. and on Saturdays at 9 p.m., our live session seeks to offer perspectives from our imams and our guest speakers with advice and insights on getting the most from Ramadan. Join us at facebook.com slash masjid. Next, our Quran scavenger hunt brings some new and interesting perspectives uh, for us to connect with the Qur'an this month. You can follow us on Instagram and Facebook for a weekly scavenger hunt with clues from various parts of the Qur'an. You can win a prize for being the first to solve all of the clues. The clues will be released on Fridays at 2 p.m. insha'Allah. 
We hope that this helps us to uh, connect with the Quran, to explore the words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and help us to better understand these beautiful words of wisdom from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala speaking directly to us. We look forward to your participation as we help each other get through this difficult and challenging situation while still reaping the rewards that Ramadan brings. Your donation and contributions towards the masjid expenses, towards the masjid upkeep, and our loan repayment are greatly appreciated. Make a contribution today at our website, go.assadiq.org slash donate. We thank you all for your support. For over 30 years, you have been with us, and we pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accepts our fast, accepts our dua, accepts our charity, accepts our prayers, accepts our recitation of Quran, and accepts all good deeds during this blessed month. Most importantly, we ask that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allows us to get the benefit of Ramadan and benefit of fasting that he prescribed for us, which is that we may be counted amongst al-muttaqoon, the pious. Thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.